Kaba Malamangil, Naranik Kaya, Wurundjeri Willamik, Woirangik, Nyungodjin Wuminyat Bikduik. My name's Kai Nikusumud. I'm a Wurundjeri Jajarang and Nulay Ilamarang woman. And I've been doing art for roughly three years professionally, and I love to do my art to showcase my culture and to tell my people's stories. We're here in Peel Street Park, Collingwood, the traditional lands of my people, the Wurundjeri people, uh, where the artwork is placed on the building on all four corners. I was commissioned by Yarra City Council to create an artwork relating to Aboriginal Lives Matter and it was put on t-shirts and that went really well so then they further asked to have the artwork be put on a building uh, here and we had to adapt it so that the artwork could fit around the whole building and we, uh, we implemented more elements and we changed it around but yeah the meaning is still the same. So Bunjil is the creator spirit of Wurundjeri people. His, his physical form is the wedged tail eagle and his spirit lives in the stars. So uh, he created all living things, so I think it's important to incorporate him and his strength in the artwork. Yeah, the managum leaves represent Wurundjeri people. Uh, we use the managum leaves to cleanse and do smoking ceremonies and it symbolises cleansing of spirits and uh, welcoming people onto country. And when we dance as well, we sweep the ground with the gum leaves to represent cleansing. And Managum, uh, Wurundjeri actually uh, the Managum people, so it fits well with uh, my people. The water symbols, they represent the Birirang, the Yarra River. The Yarra River is a very significant river to my people. It is the river of mist and uh, it's very important to incorporate that because water gives us life, water is everything. So. Yeah, it symbolises also uh, renewal and uh, healthiness and also a positive future. In the middle there's a fist and that fist represents the Black Lives Matter movement and the Aboriginal Lives Matter movement. Uh, the incarceration and deaths in custody, um, police brutality within Aboriginal Australia is at an alarming rate. So uh, this artwork symbolises the strength and resilience and uh, of Aboriginal people and to hopefully make change within the Australian community and uh, raise awareness about this issue. So I think uh, this artwork is really uh, a powerful symbol in the middle of the city um, on a big building uh, to acknowledge and when people walk past here they'll, be, they'll, um, they'll see that and they will question it and they will, uh, they will start thinking within themselves. So I think it's a really amazing thing to have it in a public, uh, in a public light. So the colours of the Aboriginal Lives Matter writing are in the um, Aboriginal flag colours, so representing uh, my people in the artwork through the colours. Uh, also the matter has all the skin tones and I think it's important to have that as um, Aboriginal people we come in all different shades and colours and shapes. So I think it's a, it's a replica of um, diversity within Aboriginal Australia. As a young Indigenous artist I uh, hope my future uh, consists of inspiring other Indigenous people and young girls, young people in the community to, to fight for what they believe in and um, showcase that, that in their own unique way. I hope the future for me is filled with education and educating people of the truth of Aboriginal Australia and especially within my family of the Wurundjeri people and Aboriginal Victoria because it's not told uh, in schools truthfully, um, which relates to the truth, healing and justice on the building. Um, healing is a really important part of our community um, which can only be done if the truth is told and through allies supporting us and helping us educate and get the, the word out there. Um, truth also obviously within the school system and in the government as well. Um, and justice, justice relating to um, the incarceration and police brutality of young Indigenous people, Indigenous people all over the world. Um, and minorities all over the world, um, we need justice and this artwork really showcases that.